welcome to Dina Adventures. Today I am going on an adventure with my mother actually because Nigel is at work. We are going to the Lincolnshire Road and Transport Museum. I think I've got that right. Um, they're having an open day so we're going to check that out. I'm currently at home, I'm running a bit late because you know it, it's Sunday and it's my only day off this week. So I had a teeny tiny lion. I set my alarm and snoozed it for half an hour. Oops. Anyway, better get on and pick the mother up. Just saying goodbye to the kitty cats who I'm very jealous of because they are getting to sleep in. Look at them. Cutie booties, this is Minnie and this is Mickey. And all they do is sleep all day. Lucky them. Anyway, I'll get on with the day and I will speak to you in a minute. <laughs> so we are here at the Lincolnshire Road Transport Museum in Lincoln, near Lincoln Park, Jonathan, North Highcourt, Virtual Pool. Very windy, but it's dry and it's still quite warm. -ish. I'll tell you the Lincolnshire Echo is not every night it is just weekly I believe it's weekly on a Wednesday but I'm not sure Is that the sort of registrations you remember, Mother? Did they? Oh yeah, I can imagine. That's a basket. <laughs> I feel like we had a car like that.
This is one of the last ones built and it was restored by the Co-op Transport Department in the library of the 1960s.
just in the queue to get on a vintage bus to go on a ride on a vintage bus I should say. Excited mum, it looks like a bus that you used to go on as a child. Probably. <laughs> and let's see what this entails. See if it's a bumpy ride. This is the bus that we're going on. We're going on the Skegness bus. Don't think it's going to take us to Skeg though. <laughs> but it would be nice. Don't stand on the seats. It's going to be a bumpy ride. We've got the buses over there as well. So here I am on the bus I showed you going to Skegness. We just went on a trip around Lincoln. But look how short it is. I'm five foot four and that is the ceiling. So I'm just going to show you around the top of the bus.
This is the top of the bus. These are the seats. And I noticed halfway round, there's no bell. But then mum said, they're on the ceiling. Which she remembers as a child. Obviously I don't. This is the top deck. And this is the back seat of the bus, the emergency door. And on the back of the seats, there is somewhere to extinguish your cigarette. How fun is that? Now I'm just gonna take you down the stairs. Very steep stairs. I'm glad the bus stairs aren't like this anymore. And then this is the downstairs of the bus, it has side seats, just at the back here. And then as you come to the front, it has a bench seat all the way along the front. And the driver would sit in there. And smoking is not permitted downstairs and the upstairs only. There's handles to hold on to. And again, the call buttons are in the roof to make the bus stop. I mean, there is an emergency door, but I don't understand why when there is just a step up. So now I'll take you on the wrap the side, going round, round the outside. This is the front of the bus that we just went on. The driver's window. This is the driver's cabin. I mean, to get up, you have to stand in that hole there. That's your foothold. I mean, it's a tiny, tiny gap for the driver. Here is our bus that we just got off, reversing out for its next run. And I was sat right up there. short trip <laughs> short and sweet but it's only a small place I think we've been here about two hours yeah. um, including the bus journey which was about 25 minutes yeah but we got to look at all the old style buses and the fire engine 
which you will have already seen, so I don't know why I'm telling you. <laughs> but yeah, we really enjoyed it. So it's just one tick off Mum's bucket list. <laughs> it's not that I'm going anywhere. <laughs> so we'll catch you next time on Dina Adventures. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to know when our next videos are up. Thank you very much for joining us. See you next time. Bye.